All right, let's start it up. We are back with another game of Deceive Inc. Today we are running Chavez back for one last job again. Ah, perfect. Loadout today. Um, the main thing we're using today that's different is the expertise. Okay. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> You're using expertise three, the return to sender. So got a couple comments on my thoughts on this one and how to use it. Um, I wasn't aware it worked on, I'm actually going to go back to that green room, on like NPC like guard shooting you, and you could charge up your shots based on that, so that is good to know. So you could, um, I don't want to say cheese it, but you can have a guard or mini guards charge you and then just kind of hold that. Um, so I'm going to see, going to try it. Um, we'll see how I like it. Generally not a big fan of abilities that make my opponent need to do something, like shooting the shield. Uh, also, like Red's Heartbreak, I've mentioned in the past, not a big fan of the way that works. Uh, so we'll see. Uh, also accompanying us, we got the Weapon 1, which I have suddenly forgot the name of. So pretty standard weapon. The only one of Chavez weapons not to get hit in the last nerf. Um, so it remains good, remains the standard. Um, man, I always think that's my tripwire. I'm just the guy running around outside right now. Uh, we're actually going to A though. Is a Hans fighting though? It's near us? Oh, it's up. Uh, I guess we're gonna like sixth party this because I hear so many different people right now. Let's see what we can do. Uh, come down the hall. I missed. I missed. I need to warm up with this gun, apparently. It takes a couple warm-up shots. Why am I not getting cover back? Okay. Super weird. We got just the staff, so we shouldn't be overly suspicious. I thought about transforming into a guard, but I thought someone might be coming back, so... I'm just gonna do this. Easy. Hey, really, uh, I think that's the trip boy I'd like to set up, where it's, uh... They go in? They did. Okay, we can do that. Okay, gotta line that up. We'll head on in. Oh, oh, oh. Perfect. Perfect. Don't care. As long as you're not shooting me, I don't care. Great. Maintain our staff cover. Got the Hans there. We didn't get that red. That red got away. Uh, I needed a couple warm-up shots there. When you uh, switch games and back to this one, if you're not used to the sensitivity, uh, it'll uh, punish you for it like that. So, a couple bad shots at the start, but made up for it. We now have almost a full rainbow already. We got all the key codes, so we are just going to go from room to room. And I'm going to, oof, yep, it's this roof. I'm going to try to maintain the, what is closest? Looks Updating like. Coordinates. Maintain the staff outfit, because staff are really not suspicious in this game, because a lot of people go for the goat outfits, obviously. I'm just going to heal there. Do a little sprinting. I haven't even used the expertise yet. Um. But yeah, we can. We don't really care about that. We just go. Vault terminal successfully located. If anyone needs shot, well, we can handle that too. The, designated coordinates. the one thing that maintaining the staff outfit does make difficult is uh, getting a blue. So, let's... can sneak up behind you. Switch. Get this blue. Great. And we should leave, but we'll grab some more stuff. So now we got the full rainbow. I'm going to leave and try to switch back to a staff outfit. Um, that was a player, right? I'm not crazy. They're jittering and I can't shoot them? The fuck is that stutter stuff? Oop, it's the head. I'm missing. Okay, there we go. 
we heal our grey health back, and we got our cover back. I missed an embarrassingly high number of shots. Let's buy one more of these. Um, oh, I bought and there's literally one right there. Oh well. Um, do I want to exit this or the other side? I can exit this. I have my invulnerable up. We do want to switch back to a staff member. There's one right here, but it's a little suspicious if we do it right there. Especially kids considering there was fighting. I was looking for a green room. Okay! There was a fight here. Looks like they probably traded or someone third partied. It was a long time ago because no one had upgrades. We just need to head to a green room. There's one on our left. Uh, grab a staff outfit and probably sit down for a few seconds. Still haven't got to use the expertise. There's never been a reason to, in my opinion, yet. Um, I know the invulnerability isn't like the only thing it does, come on, but come it's on. definitely kind Work. of something it does do. Hope they get a break now that now this is awkward, hopefully nobody cares. Nobody seemed to care. Two of the same staff walked out of that. Quick heal. Um, we can try C. Set. Good thing I clicked the line, because I was going to go the other way. So, again, we're back to staff. Pretty inconspicuous. I just like to not be a guard. Obviously, I think A would have been better, but we've clicked C and I'm on my way now. We'll run into a fight on the way. Also, oh no, that was D. We just did that. That's where we just came from. Uh, don't think they were a player. That's a little suspicious, but it does happen sometimes. These two in front of us. See if anyone makes odd movements, but so far nothing. So far still nothing. Yeah, a little odd movement from the one. It's gonna go. Okay. I should tripwire this. Stay right here. Let's see. Okay. Like you have found a we got the last one, which means we are going to have to make our way to the vault kind of quickly. Let's see if I can't remember how to get there fast. We are going to want to be on the bottom floor. We're going to have to hop in a window, but... Ta-da! Right got us there at the end. It. And now we're going to just sprint the whole way. Uh, we will need a guard outfit, though. This is the one time. I mean, technically I don't, but uh, I could just go the whole way. Scout outfits are only recommended for this area, really. Come on, come here. Nothing to see here. Move along. Let's see what we can do. a turn or something. Come on, now it looks like I'm hacking the door. Go get this one. Never got into this computer stuff. Up. I can break those. If I was gonna be this aggressive, I probably shouldn't have bothered with the tripwires, because I've placed two and they didn't really do anything, so. Definitely the first person here, by far. Gold yeah, <laughs> no one's around. Agent yeah, we're gonna grab activated. the four here. Rival Would like to switch. Mode. There is someone. Initializing agent mode. Stop right there, criminal scum. She in there? She's, in. She's either right under me or in there. What? Really? How oh, is that not the someone? It's fine, we can use it to our advantage. Agent detection mode engaged. Excuse me? I can't hit this person? Yeah, shoot me. Shoot me. And then I had to reload and it went away, didn't it? Okay, well, 
We did use it, we just didn't get to use it effectively. But uh, that was our Chavez game. Go away! There we go. Let's just cover up. There we go, make the run a little easier. So that's our Chavez game. That's the same, we really only used expertise once and we didn't really need it, so... I think this one's just straight up better than the uh, the one. It seems to last about the same amount of time and you get an advantage. Um, even though I don't like the fact that my opponent has to do something, it is a little bit better, so... Uh, please leave a like if you did, a comment on your thoughts, and I will see you in the next video. We're going to wait for the stats screen. I know not everyone likes to watch it, but I know some people do like to see the actual stats Maybe at the I end. So, uh, chill out until that comes up. And then pop off. Only three elims, not too bad. Kind of just ran around and won the game. And of course I leveled up so we don't get to see the stats that quickly. There we go. There's the stats for anyone who wanted to see them. I will catch you in the next one.